So good evening, guys. Welcome to uh, our, my sessions for Lightning Talk. Uh, today, I would like to update my working process in uh, Microsoft Learn Student and Master. So first, uh, I would like to introduce myself. OK. So my name is Charan Thon Lim Siro, and you can call me Boat. Uh, you can contact me uh, any platform that you like, maybe LinkedIn or Instagram or maybe like Facebook, you can use at both C H I N T H N. I'm currently um, being beta Microsoft Learn student and master, and also I am a Google Developer Student Club, and I'm currently studying in KMUDT in Computer Engineering and contributor in Creators Garden. My field of study is about like uh, uh, data science and machine learning. First up, uh, I would like to meet in Microsoft Learn Student. Uh, <laughs> sorry. Uh, first, uh, I would like to meet in Microsoft Learn Student and Master, who, uh, which is a tech community that uh, combines all the students who enjoy or really interesting on technology. Actually in Microsoft technology and accelerate innovation on many projects or many types of work. Maybe it's just like data works or maybe like uh, many works that they would like to show. And they also use Azure as the main purpose. So um, next thing is the milestone and benefit. We have uh, three milestones, alpha, beta, and goal. And this is a price of the kit that we are receiving. So if you, um, you would like to uh, interest to join in the community or join to the program, you can submit on MVP community's website. So how Microsoft Student Master uh, use Python in working process? As I, uh, as I said before, uh, we use various types of work to perform our functions and features from this language. So what's the part of that? We use on data science and data engineering, or maybe just DUI interactive programming, like games or software. Um, the next thing is artificial intelligence, or maybe just like machine learning or education sector. And also, as you can see, web development. There are a lot, but the highlight is on data science and uh, artificial intelligence for machine learning. So I have a story on myself. I, I have a fight with my, my girlfriend. Uh, I am a student ambassador in Thailand and uh, AI enthusiast. I use Python in VS Code, but my girlfriend, she used um, Python via Google Collab. It's like being in conflict together and we, we can re relate it, right? Yeah, I, I got a break off with her. So somebody said, really? No, just kidding. <laughs> so uh, let's ask for all of you. Uh, let's just raise your hand up. If you see use Jupyter in VS Code, please raise your hand. Ah, OK. Uh, did uh, somebody use uh, Google Collab for now? Or uh, maybe trying on uh, GitHub code space. Have you tried it before? OK, never mind. <laughs> so uh, our previous work that we use on Jupyter, or maybe like uh, in Python notebook, we have to train on MNIST or for machine learning. And also, we have uh, visualized on uh, electric charge visualizations. And also, we changed uh, the con um, conversion from R to Python for uh, the book named The Art of Statistics from Sir David Sp Spicer Halter. And also, we do a linear transformation for visualization with searching for eigenvectors and also with time series predictions. Maybe you just like to uh, find out how we work in uh, GitHub repository. And also, I did uh, using on Jupyter Notebook and also for training data in uh, this session since I do in Azure Developer Day. And also, I have uh, demonstrations for Python in Excel before. And lastly, uh, 
I would like to suggest to all of you, if you would like to try to challenge yourself on PyCon Thailand health skill challenge, so you can uh, scan here. Uh, so I live for five trends uh, for 2024. Uh, it's like LLMs, co-pilot, or maybe just uh, training on data, uh, fixing on beta UX, um, talking about agents and flexibility. And the next sessions before holiday seasons, I would like to hold um, the meeting or e um, workshop sessions on 19 December on how to use a proper pond of Microsoft designers. And thank you for watching. <laughs>